Good afternoon. <clears throat> it's actually afternoon. Imagine that. Right, close enough. Don Burnside, Don Burnside.com. Wine the Frog Video Hour. I want to say it's November 23rd. I think that's right. It's at 12.30 in the afternoon. On what is turning out to be just a delightful Arizona day. According to my weather app, it's uh, 63 degrees. Very nice. Throw up the windows for you. We're running errands. Folks, I would like to talk to you today about those pants. You guys always get a giggle and a chuckle and whatever whenever I mention pants. That was lunch today. Del Taco. Look, Del Taco. Uh, I'm not a pants wearing guy. And let's be clear when I say pants, I mean long pants, like jeans, or khakis, or corduroy pants, or slacks. Long pants. I'm not a pants wearing guy. I'm a shorts wearing guy. Short pants. Usually, you know, short pants go just to the knee as opposed to all the way down to the foot. Pants, shorts. I've lived west of the Rockies my entire life. I wear shorts. A lot of people find that odd. I don't understand why a lot of people find that odd, but I do notice that it's pretty much anybody who lives east of the Rockies find that odd. Shorts are more comfortable. They're flexible. I prefer to wear shorts. I know you guys think that's weird, but that's how I do. Um, and this week I had to buy pants, which is one of my least favorite things to do. I would, I think I'd rather go to my gynecological appointment than go buy pants. And I don't see a gynecologist. I don't like buying, I don't like going shopping, period. I'm a guy, I just don't like it. I don't like buying clothes, I don't like buying pants, I just don't like doing any of that stuff. So I don't like going to the mall or mall type places where you have to go to buy clothing. And I'm not comfortable buying clothing online because of the whole, if it doesn't fit, gotta return it. That's just a pain in the ass to me. I'd rather just be able to try something on. So I uh, uh, built up my courage and my strength, got a coffee. I drove down to the Outlet Center Mall, which is next to one of the Indian casinos here in Arizona. And uh, uh, they have an Old Navy in the Outlet Center Mall. And it's uh, better there than the mall because I didn't have to go to the real mall because that just makes me like stabby. And I just don't like it. So I went down there and you know, everything in the store, 30% off today only, blah, 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 blah. I'm sure that's I will go there today and everything in the store is 30% off today only again. Uh, we're going to go this way today. And uh, I found some pants. I tried a pair on, made sure they fit. Got two pair. Pants of the khaki style, which means they're made of uh, basically like a heavy canvas type material, cotton. But they're, they're, like, uh, they're, they're like jeans, but not made of denim, made of cloth. They're a very useful pant to have. And it's my, my preferred pant of choice. Uh, of course, I like jeans, but I don't have any jeans that fit me. Uh, I put them on. I think they're made by Omar the Tent Maker. Those will go in my donation bag. Of course, I have to take the Goodwill this week. So, what are my pants? Uh, long pants? Long pants are like jeans, like khakis, like slacks. Short pants? Shorts. Pants only go to the knees. Now, that's here in the United States. Uh, when you start talking about the difference between U.S. and U.K. pants, well, that's a whole different kettle of fish. U.K. pants are what we call underwear. So you can see why a lot of people giggle toward pants, right? And besides that, pants is a funny word. Say it with me out loud, will you? Pants. That's funny. It's a, it's a funny sounding word. It just is. Pants. It just sounds weird. 
pants. I always wear UK pants, however. Not that you guys care. Now you know. I'm not going to talk anymore about that. So yeah, we're just out running errands this Sunday. We're going to go right for a bike ride here a little bit. I'm a little tired. I don't know why. I've been having this lately. It's because I'm not exercising regular. That's totally, totally on me. Uh, I'm back at going to the gym though, which is nice. Because I, I went to the gym a few weeks ago and and like I had to drop 40 pounds on all of my machines just about. And it's like, yeah, I got I to gotta keep my strength up. So I'm back on the strength training routine um, and riding my bike. So I'm, gonna, I'm trying for, I don't know, two, three days a week at the gym. Uh, I went two days last week. And or this week rather. I might go tonight, maybe, although I went yesterday, so I tr I'm not sure. We'll see if, it depends on if I ride today or not, which I, I need, I'd like to go ride. Idiot drivers are today, and it, it scares me when people are driving stupid. It just makes it, it makes it rough for me to want to go out and ride my bike. But I'll, uh, maybe I'll latch up the old bike rack and trek down to the, maybe I'll go to like Tempe Town Lake, what time is it, it's noon? Maybe I'll go right around Tempe Town Lake today. That'll be something different. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't have anything else for you guys right now. I'm gonna unload my groceries, clean the kitchen. Ooh, exciting stuff, I know. And uh, plan on my bike ride for later. I hope everybody's ready for Thanksgiving. You're having a great weekend so far. And uh, you got big plans for Thanksgiving. I actually have plans for Thanksgiving now, which is pretty exciting, I didn't before. Uh, so now I do, which is nice. And um, I don't have anything else. So let's just be done. Uh, I'll talk to you guys next time. See ya.